Alright everybody, welcome back. It's your pal Al, and we are playing The Last of Us, the remastered 2014 edition. Uh, this is the last video in the series, guys. Um, number 24, part 24, and this will be the last one. Uh, sincerely, to everyone who's tuned in and watched these videos, thank you so much. This is my first ever YouTube series, and I can't be more thankful for the people that tuned into this. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you liked it. And uh, I had a great time making it. Learning a lot still, but it's just so fun. I enjoy gaming, and I appreciate everybody who's liked, subscribed, or just watched a video. All right, here's where we left the last video off. Oh boy. Let me go ahead, and you follow my lead. Okay, right behind you. And you guys will remember, Ellie can't swim, so. This, of course, isn't going to go well. This has bad news written all over it. Yeah. So is this like a subway tunnel or a... No, what was this? I don't know. This might have been just like a road or something. Okay, like come on, jump. You're gonna catch me? I got you. See? You didn't even need me. Let's get the hell off this thing. <laughs> She's over it. I don't know. Oh, it was like a tunnel. Like a highway was a tunnel or something. Somehow the river. <laughs> Oh. Ellie, Ellie, move. Oh, oh grab some. Grab some. Oh. I'm like stuck here. Oh, here comes Ellie. This is not good. I feel like my air is like running out. There's Ellie, but I feel like my air is running out. And oh, oh, come on, come on, come on! Hurry! Why would you do that to somebody giving a little girl CPR? Welcome to the Fireflies. Sorry about that. They didn't know who you were. And Ellie? She's all right. They brought her back. <sighs> you came all this way. How'd you do it? It was her. <clears throat> She fought like hell to get here. Maybe it was meant to be. I lost most of my crew across in the country. I pretty much lost everything. And then you show up and somehow we find you just in time to save her. 
Maybe it was meant to be. Take me to her. You don't have to worry about her anymore. We'll take care I of her. I worry. Just let me see her, please. You can't. She's being prepped for surgery. The hell do you mean, surgery? The doctors tell me the cordyceps, the growth inside her, has somehow mutated. It's why she's immune. Once they remove it, they'll be able to reverse engineer a vaccine. A vaccine. But it grows all over the brain. It does. Find someone else. There is no one else. Listen, you were gonna show me where she... Stop. I get it. But whatever it is you think you're going through right now is nothing to what I have been through. I knew her since she was born. I promised your mother I would look after her. Then why are you letting this happen? Because this isn't about me, or even her. There is no other choice here. Of that bullshit. March him out of here. He tries anything, shoot him. Don't waste this gift, Joe. Get up. I said, get up. Joel looks pissed. Go on. Move. I said move. Give me an excuse. Which way? What the fuck are you doing? Keep walking. I said keep walking. Where is the operating room? I ain't got time for this. Where? Where? Top floor, the far end. Damn. All right, here we go. <clears throat> All right, here comes two guys. One with a shotgun, one with a pistol. Two fireflies coming to look for me. Let me see if I can grab one. Oh, do this. I hate that. It just glitched out. I'm gonna restart that. I went to grab the guy. Uh, hit triangle. I went to grab him. And it like... Glitched out or something like that. I really don't want to start this out with a shotgun blast to the face. Alright, here comes those two guys again. You know that. What? Ethan's dead. We got that. a man down. The smugglers escaped. Locate the target and eliminate it. We'll search the other floors. That restart yes, counter button's kind of nice. Find that smuggler and shoot him on sight. Are you hiding, motherfucker? <laughs> oh no. He took like three big steps backwards. <laughs> Get off me. Oh, that would have been perfect, but when I went to choke him out, I took like 
Joel took like two, three big steps back, and I like. Otherwise, that would have been great. <coughs> All right. Well, here comes the backup. This guy's gonna come around the corner. I'm just gonna pop out and shoot him. Let's check down the hall. You guys, go check over there. If you're quiet, they'll literally talk to each other and tell you where they're going. Nice. I'm glad I got that armor piercing upgrade for this gun. Um, with this many guys though, it's shoot and relocate, shoot and relocate, hit and run. Because if I went to a straight firefight with that many guys, I'd easily die. So, go to one area, shoot, make some noise, pop to a different area, different angle. That's the gameplay. See, and they're paying attention down the hall, because that's where the noise came. Double tap. Alright, there's two more down. I need to go someplace I've never been before. Chill out for a second. Regroup. Ooh, I thought for sure somebody would be chasing me down that hall. Doesn't look like there's anything in here for me to pick up. So I thought they'd be running down after me, but they're literally posted up, hiding behind stuff right now, being quiet, which is almost worse because I, I can't see where they're at when I listen. Because they're not moving, they're not making any noise. So I need to figure out where they're hiding so I don't run around a corner and get shot. And right now I'm just going to look for uh, some crafting materials, any ammo. I doubt there's really anything in here. But I'm going to see what I can find. I think I'm going to go see if there's a hallway down here. Go down this hallway and see if I can either come up beside them and flank them. Or come up behind them. I've been making all this noise down here. I need to go. Yeah, nobody's coming. I'm gonna try to flank him, come up beside him, or behind him. We'll take that. Man, see, I don't know where they're at. I can't see them, but I guarantee you they're hiding right here somewhere. Oh, there's two of them right there. Two down. Let's see if anybody comes after me. And they do not. Yeah, these guys are holding up. One, two, three, four. There's a big group of guys down there at the end. never been in this room. See, I'm worried I'm going to come around a corner and get shot because these guys aren't running around. It's real easy to lose track of somebody. One, two, three, four. Huh. Yeah, let's go get them then. I think it's just those four, actually. Ooh, nice toy. New rifle. Got 36 rounds. I like my deer rifle. I'm like nervous all four of these guys are all of a sudden gonna get bum rush me here. Nice. Well, if they're gonna give me ammo for it, I'm gonna use it. I'm 
We'll let Mr. Firebarker do some work here. So this guy's literally sitting around the corner just waiting for me to come around the corner so he can shoot me. Look at that. Bet I can hit him with a grenade from here. Oh jeez, here comes a bunch more. Oh, nice. Well, there's six of them, like there. I was right too, there was three guys standing there and when I threw that grenade and blew them up, there was like two or three other guys in it ran out of the woodwork. I don't know if they were hiding around the corners for me, just waiting or what. This guy, if he wouldn't have his flashlight on like an idiot, like I probably wouldn't even be able to see him. I wouldn't know where he's looking or what he's doing. Uh, trying to get him to turn his head. I might just pop out and shoot him. Yeah, that worked out. Alright, I think that's everybody in this area. Now I need to pick up some crafting materials real quick. Ammo, whatever they dropped. Take it. I don't even know why I'm messing with this stuff. I need. I should just. No, I've already been in here. stuff. I'm so, oh man, look at this place. A couple well-placed nail bombs will take care of like, there's like six guys, well, three and three, but that's what happens when they group up like that. You get a nice well-placed bomb and, well, keep thinking there's like a firefly pendant or a manual or a comic or something somewhere in here but something back jeez oh it's another group of them I mean I could just leave them alone but search every incident war find this guy now <laughs> nail bombs nice got a uh, PhD in nail bombs. Man, those nail bombs do work. This makes me nervous. I knew he was going to poke his head up sooner or later. Anybody else? Nope, just him. Alright. Uh, 
Did he drop any ammo? Yes, he did. Uh, is there anything down here? Oh, there was something. I think that's about it for this area. Yeah, I, I think that's about it. Let's get out of here. Yeah, I think we killed everybody on that floor, but better safe than sorry. fungal growth in the limbic regions I'll tell you that right now heard that I don't know I <clears throat> definitely one of those do the ends justify the means kind of things because I get they're trying to make an ana like an antidote and yada 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 but I mean I don't want them to kill Ellie you know I don't I, and not only that but they never got her permission she was passed out from swallowing too much water and then they just prep her for surgery like come on now like even though she'd probably give him the go ahead like i don't know i'd still have trouble sacrificing a little girl i don't know It's 5.30 p.m. April 28th. I just finished speaking, I don't know, more like yelling at our head surgeon. Apparently there's no way to extricate the parasite without eliminating the host. Fancy way of saying we gotta kill the fucking kid. And now they're asking for my go-ahead. The tests just keep getting harder. And harder, don't they? I'm so tired. I'm exhausted. And I just want this to end. So be it. This looks promising. I mean, at this point, I'm good on ammo, good on crafting materials. I'm just trying to get to Ellie as fast as possible because I'm worried if 
and they're gonna start carving her up. There's nobody up here. So Marlene feels bad about it, at least. You know, she's doesn't. Yeah, look at all this. Oh, this is Marlene's stuff. Finally crossed the Utah border. In a couple days, we'll be back with the others. Today, the crew is much better spirit. So this is like, oh, Ellie never made it. March 23rd, we arrived at the hospital. So this is her journal from when we left Boston like a year ago told me the news I couldn't eat couldn't talk to anyone oh man how was I supposed to know the fire fl fly escorts were dead so she thinks Ellie died that's what this is I failed you Anna I failed all of us I should have kept her with me instead of handing her off to a couple smugglers I, I can't stand talking to any of them one of our scouts just radioed in. He spotted an older man with a young girl into the tunnel by the business terminal. He thinks she might have had red hair. What if it's her? Stop doing this, Marlene. The recon, recon squad is out. I'm going to find them. She's alive. They're running tests on her now. I can't tell if I'm excited, scared, or just nervous. All I know is my hands will stop shaking. Yeah, so that's her journal from like when they she hired Tess and uh, Joel to smuggle uh, Ellie until now she basically thought because it's taken like a year she basically thought that uh, she was dead Over there. oh jeez so, there's a ton of guys in here oh. I'm gonna grab him oh he just like stopped well, if he comes this way, I'm gonna grab him, choke him out. If he turns around, I'm gonna just shoot him. Nothing. Those armor-piercing rounds are nice. Oh my gosh, did you see all those guys? Lucky for me, I got plenty of bullets. Nice. We all know what I can do with some nail bombs. Oh, now they're sitting, sitting still. Sneaky, tricksy little hobbitses. <laughs> he saw me. It was too late. Now they're all moving around. This is when you gotta be careful because they'll like run around the corner not knowing you're there and you'll get blasted. You know what? I've been complaining I don't use my spoke smoke bombs ever, so might as well, right? So at least that half of the, the room over there aren't, aren't gonna shoot at me because they can't see me. These guys can still see me though. But I can also see them. It at least closed off half the room, made it a little more fair. Here we go. Yeah, the smoke bomb made it so only three guys were shooting at me instead of like eight. There we go. Not sure. Here we go. I don't know how the shotgun's gonna do on body. Oh, question answered. Wow, that was close range with a shotgun, and it still took two two shots. I think there's just this one guy up here. I'll use my AR. 
the close range. There we go. Oh my gosh, he's still alive? Well, he's dead now. What? <laughs> what? Okay. I get it the first time I shot him in the head, he had a helmet on. Second time I shot him in the face without a helmet. And he was... Okay, anyways, we got him. Toughest man alive right there, boy. That should buy me some time. Man, how many soldiers these guys have? Oh, there's Ellie. What are you doing in here? I won't let you take her. This is a... Don't... D-E-D -E -D dead. You fucking animal! Terry, shut the hell up! Come on, baby girl. I got you. I got you. <clears throat> oh, shit. That's, oh. Wrong way. Wrong way. Shit. I'm getting you out of here, girl. I got you. I got you. Come on. Well, which way? And they won't shoot at me because they don't want to risk hitting her. Not. Stop. can't save her. Even if you get her out of here, then what? How long before she's torn to pieces by a pack of clickers? That is, if she hasn't been raped and murdered first. It ain't for you to decide. It's what she'd want. And you know it. Look. You can still the right thing here. She won't feel anything. Turns out there's a whole lot more like you, Ellie. People that are immune. There's dozens, actually. I ain't done them a damn bit of good, neither. They've actually... They've stopped looking for a cure. I'm taking this home. Wait! 
Let me go. Please. You just come after her. Damn. Joel gets rough when someone goes after Ellie. Shot through here. All right. Yeah, so kind of pretty, ain't it? Yeah. <clears throat> So Ellie was asleep that whole time, when she watch your head going through. when she almost drowned there, and and Joel had to give her uh, CPR. She didn't wake up again until she was Doing like in the now. in the car on the way home. I don't think I ever told you, but uh, Sarah and I used to take hikes like this. I think uh, I think the two of you would have been would have been good friends. I think you really would have liked it. I know she'd like you. I bet I would have. Oh. Right down there. Oh, that's Jackson. Just a little bit further now. That's where Tommy lives when they have electricity and. Back in Boston? Back when I was bitten? I wasn't alone. My best friend was there. And she got bit too. We didn't know what to do. So... She says... Let's just wait it out. You know, we can be all poetic and just lose our minds together. I'm still waiting for my turn. Ellie. Her name was Riley, and she was the first to die. And then it was Tess. And then Sam. None of that is on you. No, you don't understand. I struggled for a long time with surviving. And you... No matter what... You keep finding something to fight for. Now, I know that's not what you want to hear right now. Swear though, to me. Swear to me that everything that you've said about the Fireflies is true. I swear. Thanks again to absolutely everybody who watched this video. This was my very first YouTube series I ever recorded. Um, I'm new at this at this point, but sincere gratitude to everybody who liked, subscribed, or just watched any of this. Thank you for going on that ride with me. This is one of my favorite games of all time, and I loved uh, being able to share with you guys, and I hope you enjoyed it. All right, one last time, this is your pal Al. And thank you guys very much.